Hey everybody, welcome to a new episode of Chad's Trains and Things and new Lego video. As it's another one of the new Lego Super Mario set 71383, Wiggler's Poison Swamp. And there's one more set that I haven't got yet for the new run. I'll be done, but all these will go on the Lego train layout going on. So I'm not sure if this go on Lego Wednesday or if I'll just put this up earlier and put something else up. For Lego Wednesdays, I got a lot of sets I'm building right now. We shall see. Anyway, let's get a better look. What you get in it? It's a nice purple base for poison, which is the new color for the Lego stuff. Get Wiggler, a Goomba, and a Koopa Paratroopa. And this one. Back. Let's take a look at the back. Kind of shows the starter set and how it adds on. And just gives you some ideas. Try to get so the light ain't quite hitting it right. What it can do. And pause. Always you got to use phone or iPad or something in order to get building instructions. Back out. Take a knife here and see if I can do this one-handed. And the answer to that, I think, is going to be no with my left hand. Try to hold on to it. I need to get my... And she's open. And stuff it all out. Too. The box. Three. Six. Bag one, I'll throw off this side. Two. Three. It's like six bags. And a little book. Which, of course... Just shows different things that are available to it all. It's all folded up. Bag one, not a whole lot in it. Of course, possess Mario. <laughs> Anyways, I'm gonna get started building this. And I'll come back after bag one for sure, because bag one, when it's done, it's what you use Mario for to get it into the app. Showing that you own it. So, see you in a few. Okay, bag one is done. Has a real quick build. Built the poop. The Koopa Paratroopa was built. It's real cool, little wings. I like the little clear stand too to make it look like he's flying. Let's get my fingers out of the way here. My bad hands. Try to give you closer looks on it all. Eyes. His little wings, and of course I'm back, but Mario stomps on to get points. And creepy Mario is now lit up, I turned him on. Um, knock him over, let's see if I can do that, maybe where y'all can see. There, see? Got him. There, and I got a coin with Mario. Mario smiled. Stand him back up. Maybe. There we go. There's bag one's build. Of course, Mario watching what's going on. I'll check back soon. I start bags two. Okay, had to come back after bag two as we just built the Wiggler, which was actually a really cool build how they did it to hook it all together. Use a lot of the same parts, everything else. He's looking at you. It's like a plant growing on his head. This is like the main creature you battle. Well, I guess you don't battle it because there's nothing on it for Mario to jump on and get points or anything else. I guess he's just got to avoid it. But there's four identical builds in the head. It's just attached using Legos. Like it's coming out, there's a piece underneath. So it can't go down. And it can't go up. So, yeah, just want to show you that. I thought this was a really cool build. I'll check back later. And I'm back with a final look of Wiggler's Poison Swamp. Show you the whole setup, how they show it. Like I said, once I start getting it all set up, everything's going to be built different. Make it all fit. Just... Gives you an idea of what they're showing. 
This piece you put Mario on, bring him back and forth. It's kind of hard using your hand to film. This is a neat thing. Put Mario on here. I'm not going to be able to do it with one hand because the whole thing moves. See? But if you move it, you go real hard that way. The tails will hit this, which causes that to unfold. Reveal the hem. The little Goompa on him. As Mario's going back and forth, he's supposed to get points and everything too on it. Coins. But it's a pretty big setup. Bigger setup. Anyways, that's the Lego Super Mario set 71383. Wiggler's Poison Swamp, another swamp. There's one more swamp piece left to get and put together. And then there's only a few more sets I got, which I may pick up, but they're just going to be for parts for to fill in areas because the Lego Mario area on my table is about maxed out now, thanks to the ghost area and the castle area. Anyways, always don't forget to like and subscribe. Hit that little notification button if you want to be notified anytime I have new videos out. And I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.